Anyways, uh, you thought you were all up to speed on the whole social networking thing with Facebook and Twitter and mm -hmm. all the other ones out there. Well, there's one that's getting a lot of buzz, but this one's just for doctors. It allows doctors to stay in contact with other doctors across the country and get other professional opinions on their patients. Well, this is a good idea. I know, and it's interesting. Yeah. Alexis Vance is giving us a look at that. In the medical world, it always seems like there's something new, and many doctors are turning to social networking to stay in touch. It's really important for, especially in the cancer field, where we see a lot of very um, unusual and unique cases, um, to be able to reach out across the country to experts and collaborate in that way. This social networking site is called Doximity. It's HIPAA compliant, and the website is fully secure. It also has all my colleagues on there, so I have their cell phones and their text pages and uh, something called um, DocText, which is a secure text messaging system that is all encrypted and compliant to protect patients' information so we can communicate with each other during the day about patients that we're both taking care of. On it, doctors can write about a patient's situation, diagnosis. They can find colleagues, phone numbers, look at clinical cases. As sometimes, unfortunately, doctors can be hard to get a hold of, and this this kind of technology really brings people closer together. All right, so Doximity, the name of the site, is fully up and running right now for doctors. We'll keep you updated on that because it really is a huge advantage.